All right, so now we've got this face unwrapped. So let's just bring up the UVs for that and we can see that all unwrapped and we've got the seams and uh, we've taken the shells apart. So now all we have to do is take it to ZBrush for unwrapping. So uh, let's do that. Uh, now you could use the Gozi plugin, which actually sends meshes to and from um, ZBrush. Uh, however, it doesn't like five-sided uh, polygons. Now I've got a few five-sided polygons, which Maya handles quite fine, but ZBrush doesn't like it at all. So uh, a much easier way to do it if that Gozi doesn't work is to do it manually. And this is uh, quite a good one to remember. Just export as an OBJ. So we just go export selection <coughs> to the desktop, say as an OBJ. Uh, and uh, if you can't find that OBJ uh, up, just find that in, set, in the plugin manager, which is under Windows, uh, Settings and Preferences. Uh, OBJ, uh, I always have a bit of trouble finding it, but it's just here, OBJ export bundle needs to be loaded if you cannot see the export to OBJ. So we export that out as a file and I'll, I'll do that now and load it up in ZBrush. All right, so now that we're in ZBrush, we just have to import an OBJ. And the way you do that, if this comes up, just click on the light box and we can close that. Uh, we're actually importing a tool. So tools in ZBrush are OBJs, or are just models. So we need to import an OBJ. We can come and click on that and just import it in from the desktop, which uh, head to ZBrush. Let's just import that in. <coughs> now this uh, will come up if you have five-sided or more polygons in your scene. Uh, we can just now click on quads and triangles compatible with Z2. Now our head will come up here in a little icon here and we can just click and drag and click and drag and just don't do anything and we need to go into 3D mode so we come straight up into the edit mode. That's basically 3D mode so we can click on that <coughs> and now we can sort of toggle around our object by mousing over and hitting F twice we can center that object uh, more into the center.